Hello friends, in this video we are going to learn how to implement PCD to accessory code converter using NAND gates only and this is a circuit diagram for PCD to accessory code converter using NAND gates and now you might be confusing that how to get this PCD to accessory code converter using NAND gates only. There is a simple logic behind it which I am going to share with you and I have done this project as a part of my assignment in the course Digital VLSI Design under the guidance of Dr. Cherry Vargav and Shruti Patak and this is a truth table for BCD to accessory code converter and there are boolean equations by using KMAPS we are going to get the boolean equation from the truth table just double complement the equations which you are getting by using NAND gates by using two NAND gate series we are going to complement the equations which we have got and now we are going to see the execution of the inputs and getting the output when we are going to give the input 1 the accessory code converter output is 4 that is 1 plus 3 equal to 4 and now when we are going to give the input 2 the accessory code converter output is 5 that is 2 plus 3 equal to 5 so we are getting the 5 output and now 3 input is 3 and the output 6 that is 3 plus 3 equal to 6 and the input is now 4 and 4 plus 3 equal to 7 and that is a BCD to accessory code converter because 4 plus 3 equal to 7 and 5 now input is 5 and output is 8 so it is working perfectly and we can say that it is a PCD to accessory code converter working very perfectly and 6 plus 3 is equal to 9 and 7 plus 2 7 plus 3 is equal to 10 and this is how a BCD to accessory code converter is going to work and now the input is 8 and 8 plus 3 equal to 11 that is the PCD to accessory code converter and now the input is 9 and 9 plus 3 is equal to 12 and uh, this is a C programming language for BCD to accessory code converter and here are the header files which I have included for necessary and uh, I have taken the float variables A and C into variable end and I am displaying a message for the user and I am giving a scan of statement to store the element to store the element A and it stores the number which is entered by the user and here it is asking to select the access to, to BCD to accessory code converter and here I am seeing that C equal to A plus 3 which means the number which the user have entered it is going to add 3 for the number which user have entered and here it is a scan statement scan of statement which is going to store the, store the option which, be, which is selected by the user and this is a case statement like switch switch case statement and when the user is printing when the user is pressing 1 and it is going to execute the case 1 that is C equal to A plus 3 so it is going to print a the which is number is entered by the user and plus 3 which is going to access 3 now i have entered 4 and getting the output 7 so successfully implemented the bcd to accessory code converter in c programming also and now i am going to show another result that is 9 plus 1 or 9 plus 3 equal to 12 so this is successfully executing so thank you for watching if you like this video don't forget to subscribe and like and share